Hi everyone, uh, just a quick hints and tips video here. I've noticed a few people commenting saying that they are struggling because they've only got a small scanner, so an A4 scanner, and if their piece is A4 or slightly bigger, they're struggling to be able to scan their work in progress or their finished image to a nice high, high resolution. Um, I've got an A3 scanner, but a lot of all pieces that I work on are a lot bigger than that. So this program allows me to do take several scans at different um, positions on my my portrait, and then I upload them into this program. It stitches them together in a few seconds, and there you go. We've got a perfect scan, all knitted together of our finished image. So it's from Microsoft. It's a free program called ICE, and ICE stands for Image Composite Editor. So I'll just show you quickly. I mean, it, you can stitch things together. You've got, um, you can use images, videos, lots of different things that it covers, but I literally just use it at the moment for stitching together my scans. So go up first of all to the tab on the left. So you want to create a new panorama from images and then this takes you into your computer. So I'm gonna select the images that I want to stitch together. And in this case, it's four scans that I did of the same image, just rotating them on the actual scanner. So there you go, all four are now imported. So literally the next thing to do is you just go up and click on stitch. And Microsoft Ice goes and does its little bit of wonderful magic behind the scenes. Um, I kind of understand what it does technically, but there's no way I can explain it. Um, and here you go, all of those four images are now stitched together. If it turns out that the orientation is wrong, literally just pop in here. I'm going to rotate mine by 270 degrees. And there it is now, perfectly the right way up. So I'm just going to go up to the top right hand side and click next. And that's just rotating my image. There we go. Stage three up here now is you can crop if you choose to. You don't have to. You can wait till you're actually in your photo editing program at the end. So I'm just going to do a quick crop there, hit next once again, and there you have it. Your images all stitched together, um, ready to export to your folder. So go over here and just check the quality. You can export in any sort of format. You've got TIFF, PNG, um, JPEG. I'm just going to stick to keeping it a JPEG. As this is a final scan, I'm going to knock the quality right up to 90. And then you just go down to export to disk, change the file name. So I'll just call this one final scan and that will save straight to my drive where I want it. And that is it. It really is as simple as that. There is your final scanned image. OK, I hope that helps and thank you very much for watching.